Hi guys, today I'm going to do a quick review on this mascara that I found at Sephora. It is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. And of course with the name like that, you have to try it and see if it really is that good. So um, I paid $23 for this, so it's a little bit pricey, but I did have very high hopes for this because on the box it claims to have 1,944% more volume, 93% saw base to tip curl, 100% saw dramatic volume, 100% saw longer lashes, and 90% saw a dramatic look with one coat, and that is the consumer study results. So of course I had to pick it up and try it and see um, how good it was. It also says that it's film foam film forming polymer smudge proof all day wear and unique peptides deepest intense black possible so I'll go ahead and talk about my first try using this or first impression um, the very first time I used this I was kind of turned off by the product because it's a very wet product and I wasn't applying it correctly because I was just getting mascara all over the place. I was getting it on my lash line, on my lids, all over the bottom lash line, and it was just too much going on. So what I realized is that you don't need to re-dip the wand every time you use it. Meaning, I dip it, I take it out of the tube, I coat this lash, I coat this lash, I coat the bottom lash and this bottom lash, just with one application. I don't stick it in the tube every time and I've also learned that I need to wipe off the excess mascara on the very tip of the wand because then your lashes can get very very clumpy if you see here by just taking it out of the tube you get a lot of mascara on the tip so you have to clean that off but I will insert a demo of how I apply my how I apply this um, to get it to give me the best results. Uh, I used it this morning or today, so this is what my lashes look like. I don't have any false lashes on, and I apply three coats. Three coats is pretty good. You don't need to do a fourth coat. Once you start going over the three coats, it starts to look very, very clumpy and very spider leg-like lashes. So three is definitely enough. You can even do two. Um, as far as the lengthening goes, I don't see my lashes getting any longer. Um, they don't look any longer to me at all. Uh, I do get very, very good volume with this mascara. My lashes look very, very thick. I don't see a base to tip curl very much. I curl my lashes before I apply a mascara and this mascara kind of even weighs down my lashes just a little bit so they're not as curled. But it still gives me a really nice look so I, I think that's okay that I can kind of overlook that. And 90% saw a dramatic look with one coat and yes that is true. You do get really thick lashes with just one coat. And as far as, as far as it being smudge proof, that is not true. I don't know if you guys can see, but here I did get a little bit transfer on my lower lashes, which is, it's pretty easy to fix. All you need to do is apply a waterproof mascara as your last coat, or you can even get a mascara that makes any mascara waterproof. There's a really good Anastasia one, Anastasia, but very, Anastasia Beverly Hills one that I like but yeah it's the the lashes don't feel really hard or brittle they're very soft to the touch it says that it has some tree extract in the formula which nourishes and thickens and locks curl in place so overall I would give this product a four stars. I really like it. I would repurchase this. Uh, there's only three things that I don't like, and that would be that it's pretty expensive. It's $23. Uh, I don't 
really know how long this is gonna last me I'm thinking it's gonna last me a really long time since I don't need to keep uh, reapplying so much product a little bit of product goes a very long way and that it is it does smudge on the lower lash line and but it's still a good mascara if you want to have really full thick lashes I don't really see any lengthening going on with my lashes but if you want very thick voluminous lashes this is definitely a great mascara to try
hope this video was helpful. Thank you guys for watching and as always, I will see you in my next video.